any alternative energy is something we have to consider, we need to pursue. What are they trying to hide? If this is a great thing, why can't you find out information on it? Why is it so secretive? The strobing effect when the sun gets behind where the blades are turning. You know, some people are driven crazy by it. There are times like I'll lay in my bed and it sounds like the noise is in the walls. I turned off the engine and rolled the windows down and I really listened and I was horrified. Now you have an object that's 400 and something feet tall spinning at 150 miles an hour. I mean, who would have imagined that one blade is seven tons? Try and think about that for a second. The whole turbine is you're talking 600,000 pounds. 600,000 pounds doesn't land with a whimper. Folks in one Oklahoma town feeling the ground actually shake this morning. The tremor was not an earthquake, however, rather a wind turbine. We're not against alternate sources of energy. We're against these monstrosities. Some people have looked at them and said they're beautiful. Others say well, we'll get used to them. When they build these out in the desert, they're putting them up on 6,000 acres. We don't have anything like that here. We have homes here. There were salesmen from several companies sneaking around for two years. This is green energy. This is big money. We signed a lease to have a turbine up on our hill. We'd be doing our part to end the country's oil dependency. It's not green energy, it's greed. The other reason we signed was the same reason everybody does. It's for money. We needed money. Our town was agricultural. We've lost most of our farms. It's like asking some poor miner to negotiate a good deal with Bethlehem Steel. I guess I was naive. I never thought it would be so contentious an issue. What the wind companies and corporations have done over the years is split the town. You get so many people for you. You know you're going to get so many people against you. I've referred to them as modern day carpetbaggers. They've done this many times. They have an agenda. They're very deliberate. They're very smart. This is big money, big companies, big politics. I think we were blinded by the money. I never thought, for example, what our neighbors across the road would think. Now people don't talk to each other. People hate each other. People saying vile things about each other. And it's only going to get worse.